Acting on the advice of Ghana Tertiary Education Commission, authorities of St. Monica's College of Education have lodged a case of sexual assault against the embattled Anglican priest who kissed students of the school. Reverend Father Obeng Labi kissed three female students of the school on the lips during a Sunday mass service. His conduct has since re received wild public condemnation with calls for strict sanctions against the man who has been working in the past five years as school chaplain and lawyer. He has since apologized for his conduct. Or him interior of our security desk has been on the beat for us. He joins us via Zoom with more Oheming. What's the latest from uh, your sources in the school? Thank you, Aisha. As of now, the, the man at the center of the controversy, the Reverend Father Obey Labi, is yet uh, to report to the Mampon Divisional Police Command, uh, who then extended invitation to him uh, as far as the investigations into uh, his alleged uh, sexual assault on some students on the campus of St. Monica's College of Education are concerned. Uh, the incident has uh, triggered a police investigations uh, after uh, the GTEC, uh, GTEC, uh, uh, we are told, uh, have the oversight, uh, you know, supervision and advisory uh, uh, responsibility over the College of Education Institutions in Ghana. Uh, so they are the ones uh, pressing uh, for police investigations uh, on the alleged conduct of Reverend Father mm -hmm. of the LRB. The Mampong uh, Divisional Police uh, Commander, Chief Superintendent David Koku Amwaku, has earlier on told me that indeed they have extended invitation to the man. And just this morning, they received uh, some uh, statement uh, from the school authorities and the three students uh, who were seen in the video uh, being kissed on the lips by Reverend Father Obi Labi. And uh, he says, once they've opened investigations into uh, the matter, they expect the embattled uh, chaplain and the lawyer of the St. Monica's uh, Education uh, College of Education to uh, support a police in that regard. Any attempt uh, not to respond to the police invitation will mean that he, he has disregard uh, for authority and then he will be arrested. We've cited uh, in the last few hours uh, uh, an apology letter from the Reverend Father um, the Obeng Labi. Uh, how is the school receiving this apology? For the school, uh, they, they are quite late, except to say that we have to speak to the headquarters of the Anglican Church, uh, where they have designated, you know, a exposed person on the matters like this. But uh, for them, they believe that uh, once uh, the man has apologized, uh, the invitation or the, the apology letter is well received, just that they can't uh, comment on it further. I also you know, tried uh, speaking to uh, some uh, students uh, on campus, but unfortunately uh, that did not materialize. But what we do know is that a five member committee uh, set up to investigate uh, the issue uh, on campus has already been launched. And the committee is expected to kickstart his work uh, next Monday. So the indication is that the embattled uh, chaplain of the school, Reverend Alfred Obin Labi, uh, will not be facing the uh, church investigative committee uh, only, but also be, will, he will be you know, visiting or frequenting the police station uh, as uh, police launch investigations. Uh, if, if you look at the two investigations, uh, there are two investigations uh, that will happen. One is to look into his conduct. And don't forget, uh, all these were school authorities have indicated that they are being guided uh, by the school's uh, policy on uh, sexual harassment and that of the Ministry of Education and that of uh, GTEC. Uh, so all these things will you know, come to play. And then with the police investigation, we are also looking at uh, criminal elements as far as the assault on the students are concerned. Uh, some have already raised concerns that there's likely to be uh, some bit of a 
you know, a criminal intent in that regard. Because if you watch the video carefully, the third student uh, appeared uh, to have resisted, uh, but she, you are, she appeared to have been pushed by the Reverend Minister, Reverend Father uh, Obin Labi, in that regard, to receive what he, the Reverend Minister, described as a peace case for the students having distinguished themselves as members of the school's the chaplaincy board. Ohemin Teria is with our security desk and he's been giving us updates on the issue with the priest who kissed three female students.